This tutorial is going to talk about using the Extract by Mass tool in ArcMap. You often do this when you're trying to uh, trim a larger raster data set. If you're trimming a vector data set, you'd want to use the Clip tool, which is under Analysis Tools and Extract. But in this case, we have a land cover map, which is a uh, 30 by 30 raster image that we actually want to trim uh, to just this particular area. Now, in some cases, uh, all of your uh, subject area will fall under one um, land cover file or any type of raster file. In this case though we have uh, three different ones that comprise our focus area. Uh, now you can merge these ahead of time but they're pretty large files so what we're going to do is actually extract uh, these individually and then potentially merge the extracted files. To extract these though what we're going to do is go to our spatial analyst tools and go to extraction and extract by mask. And we always want to make sure that our extensions are all checked so that we can run our Arc Toolbox tools. And we're going to click this right here. Our input raster is going to be one of our layer ones. We're going to use this first one. And our uh, mask data is going to be the focus counties right here. Now, by default, it's going to send it to our default geo database. Uh, we want to change that. And we're going to change it to our Lone Oak uh, geo database and call this, uh, we'll call it LC underscore one for land cover one. Go ahead and say save and OK. Now we'll know that this is running by uh, showing extract by NAS running in the bottom right corner. It does it relatively quick. We we'll notice that LC underscore one pops up. And if I turn uh, off our top land cover, we'll notice that it's trimmed it by this. Now we might continue to do that for more counties. You can do this just to manage your data. One really nice thing though is that you can uh, go to the attribute table and you can actually see. Uh, the count of each things that you uh, each thing that you have uh, in your uh, clipped area. So for open water, we have uh, this many pixels. Uh, if you were to tally up all the pixels uh, and then divide just this particular area by the total, you could get the percent of open water. So there's some strategic analysis things that you can do uh, when you just extract uh, by mask and trim it down to just your subject area. So much like using the clip tool, Extract by Mask is a helpful way uh, to trim larger data sets based on uh, a shape file or some sort of boundary uh, that you have created.